Would you like some irrigation tips for your Lake Martin home? I'm John Coley, I'm a real estate agent here, and I'd like to give you three tips, so hang on to see them. There are a lot of Lake Martin waterfront homes that have their own irrigation systems. And when we're touring homes, a lot of times my buyers will point at these things and they'll wonder like, what are these pumps that are right by the waterfront? What are those? Well, most of the time, that's an irrigation system for the landscaping, for the landscaping around the lake house. So if you're looking to set up an irrigation system for your lake house, I'll give you three tips. And tip number one, and that apply, this applies to a lot of things around the waterfront of Lake Martin is check the Alabama power regulations for this. Anytime you're building around the, uh, the contour of Lake Martin and the 491 foot sea level, you gotta understand that Lake Martin, the bottom is owned by Alabama Power, and so therefore they have a lot of regulations around the type of construction you can do around the lakeside. So tip number one is make sure that it's okay with Alabama Power that you have a, an irrigation water pump near the water line, because what you're doing is you're pulling water out of the lake. Tip number two for your irrigation for Lake Martin is make sure it's okay with your neighborhood covenants and regulations. Sometimes some neighborhoods may have regulations around this or the type of, or the type of things you can be, build around the waterfront. So you wanna make sure you're okay with your neighborhood covenants. And tip number three is make sure you know how to drain your irrigation pump and so it doesn't freeze up in the winter. Now I know we're in, in Alabama, you think freezing in Alabama, this is not gonna happen. But you know, at least once a time, or once or twice during the winter, we'll get cold temperatures long enough that a lot of these pumps may freeze. And so the really smart folks drain their water pumps uh, right before the winter so there's no water in there and it doesn't freeze and bust up your water pump and also bust up all of your the PVC pipes that run into the lake to gather the water. Make sure you know how to do this and that way your pump will survive winter to winter. And it can be a really good way to be, use the water of Lake Martin to irrigate your landscape as long as you do it in the right way. If you have further questions about water pumps or irrigation, please don't call me. I'm just a real estate agent. I know enough to get in trouble with them, but my big tip is if you're interested in Lake Martin real estate, I'd love to help you out. I'm John Coley with Lake Martin Voice Realty.